My name is Matthew Lawrence. My name is Claire Blackman. We are about to get really drunk and do uh, Shakespeare's Much Ado About Nothing. We're playing Beatrice and Benedict. Oh. I'll let you start this one. Probably watching horror movies with my girlfriend and at one point we decided that crawling across the floor was easier than walking. Deciding that sleeping on someone's front lawn in a lawn chair was a good idea. Oh yeah, I slept in the bathtub. Yep. Um, <laughs> and then at 5.30 in the morning decided to walk home. <laughs> I have not. So, I'm this delightful mixture of excited and terrified. Um, I have performed under the influence, not theater. Um, I'm a musician in my other life, um, and have done more than my fair share of bar gigs where the beer was free and I availed myself of it uh, profoundly. Um, so yes. <laughs> I'm looking forward to giving the audience the same awesome time that I had last year watching Drunk Macbeth because it was the funniest thing I've ever seen in my life. Um, I'll s just getting shit-faced in attempting to do Shakespeare. <laughs> yeah, I think that's, I'm kind of the same in that I'm looking forward to just, the idea, it's such a taboo thing, the idea of, of yeah. drinking and then going on stage, like it's yeah. just such it's an like unprofessional professional. thing to do, yeah. So I think that's going to be just Doing that consciously is yeah. going to be lots of fun. And knowing that it's okay, that it, knowing that you're going to screw up, mm -hmm. it's going to happen, so you might as well go big or go home. Well, there's a, uh, yeah, and I think there's going to there's a certain freedom with it as well. Yeah. To like, just be drunk and let what happened happens, mm -hmm. and, and you know, not sort of get rid of that part of your brain that's that's normally working while you're on yeah. stage. I'm gonna forget my lines. Yeah. <laughs> I'm gonna have to yeah. try and improvise uh, Shakespeare. Yeah, that's that's exactly my answer as well. Yeah. Uh, improv itself, I enjoy improv, but the idea of trying to improv Shakespeare, the idea of just completely blanking on my lines and knowing that I'm not gonna be able to pull myself out of the scene is so <laughs> petrifying yep. that I just kind of have to let it go. <laughs> I mean, don't be shy. Oh, no, no, no. Uh, and some charming. Shut your face. God. Um, his modesty. <laughs> uh, uh, no, he's a, um, oh gosh. Uh, we just have great acting chemistry together, so mm -hmm. I'm really looking forward to exploring traditional lover-lover relationship while drunk with you. <laughs> I'm going to say the fact that she's uh, incredibly playful, um, and again, I know that from having done bits and pieces um, together at various points. Uh, so, and I know that's only going to increase with the addition oh, of alcohol. Will it? Uh, so, I'm looking forward to the things she's going to come up with that are going to surprise the hell out of me, and that I'm going to then have to deal with. <laughs> Twelfth night. It's our night stream. The, mm, the Merchant of Venice. Uh, the well, Tempest. Spice rum. Uh, sixteen-year-old Isla whiskey. Pirates. Need Come this. on! Oh. Uh. Just saying. <laughs> one horse sized duck. Yeah, one horse sized duck. I just wanna see I just wanna see what that looks like. Yeah, I could tame it and like ride it around. Yeah. I'd love to play Laertes. Mmm. I've been rereading Hamlet lately, and Laertes for me is almost more interesting than Hamlet. I'm gonna say the incredibly, incredibly cliche thing and go with Juliet just because I've always wanted to have a crack at her. Always. Um, because I think that she's so cool and hilarious and go. smart. Drunken Romeo and Juliet. Yes. I've been wanting to do this since I saw Drunk Macbeth last year because it's a shit show and it's amazing and 
I'm just so excited to do something that is both so terrifying and so awesome. Yeah, all I'll say is I have no idea what in God's name is going to happen. Yeah, um, that too. Whatever it is, it's going to be wonderful and it's going to be unique. Um, and everybody should come out and see it, whether you're into Shakespeare or not, because you'll be into Shakespeare after yeah. this.